the bottom structure, Hirano aims to maximize force distribution. He calls it a Yabusame rocket. It's named for a new locally made Epsilon rocket and Yabusame, traditional archery on horseback. They get right to work on the arches. First, they glue thin strips together. Next, they use 30 vices to bend the material into an ideal arch. The tightness of the vices must be adjusted very carefully. The slightest deformation in the arch will concentrate the load in a single place and cause it to break. Team turns to Nishimaki, their resident expert. He knows exactly how to adjust each vice to achieve a perfect arch. Nishimaki pays special attention to the joints. They're most likely to warp, so the vices must be extra tight in those places. He concentrates completely on the feel of the vices in his hands. Each vice must be adjusted precisely. Once tightened, they can't be redone. Long years of experience are his only guide. Okay. It looks good. So, did they make an ideal arch? Their acceptable margin of error is less than a millimeter. Did they manage to do it? 0 0.7 millimeters smaller. A professional job. Well made. Brilliantly reading the nature of the wood, they've created an excellent arch. Supreme skill! Next, they turn to paper tape. You'd be surprised. Even this paper tape is quite strong. Hirano thinks it should be enough to distribute the load. But using it is against the rules. How can they use wood instead? Hirano has his eye on wood shavings. But aren't they too weak? It's easy to break in this direction if you want to pull the fibers apart. But it stands up well to pulling. It's surprisingly strong in the direction of the grain. Can they use this to their advantage? They try 0 0.25 millimeters. It breaks almost at once. Too bad. But Hirano quadruples the thickness to 1 millimeter. Scary. Oh. A great improvement. By quadrupling the thickness, they've achieved more than 40 times the strength. It's amazing. With something so thin. The first Yapasame rocket prototype is finished. The students made it to 600 kilograms. How will the artisans do? 100 kilos, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 seconds. I think I hear the tape popping. As they pass the 400 kilogram mark, something happens. They made it to less than half 
their goal of one time. We've got a problem. How do we fix it? The artisans are in trouble. There's not a smile to be found. At this point, in terms of results, you're losing to the students. What do you think? Well, we'll see. The crucial part of their bridge is the arch.